Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of Halal Dolls and um, today we're going to be talking about paint brushes. Um, the paint brushes that I got recently were these brushes here. Now first let me show you these brushes that my sweet dear son got for me. He got these paint brushes for me from, I think it was from Walmart or from the dollar store and I don't know if you can see those little hairs that are going on up in there. Those are definitely a no-no. These little paintbrush hairs, these little brush um, bristles or whatever they are, are going to be all on your dolls. Like as you're painting, it's going to be just in the paint, and you have to stop and pick it out. So you know you don't want to don't want to mess with these. So I went to, but you know maybe for your doll houses or maybe you can come up with some creative ways to keep the bris bristles together and you know um, things like that so I probably will use them for something but I don't know about my dolls I want to show you this other paint brush that I have had this was actually something I started using for just started using for my makeup because um, this I originally had gotten this paint brush for to do detailed work and as you can see there there is some little stray um, bristles oh come on focus because focus, focus. the lighting is bad in here so I'm sorry if it if it keeps going out of focus but I'll do my best here um, you see that little stray bristle if you're doing detailed work you don't want a stray bristle because that stray bristle is going to have you know paint on it and it's gonna you know get on your on your job there so it, it's really good for like if you're doing a paint job and you want like another little wispy line yeah by all means use a brush like this uh, but I tend to like my my paint brushes to be firm and to you know have some flexibility I like flexibility and you know even with these bigger paint brushes you will have or with these good paint brushes you will sometimes have a stray and for this one it is okay um, I don't mind because I'm just going to be painting on my dolls like this you know I'll just be dipping it into the paint and then just painting it on there so that stray doesn't matter to me I've got this paintbrush from uh, Michaels and it's the Simply Simmons one stroke a three-fourth of an inch um, brush and I really like it it feels so soft and it's doing really really well for me and it's very easy to clean inshallah I'm going to try to do another video showing you all how to um, clean your brushes this brush here I also got from Michaels I really cannot read what it says but I'll give you guys a close up and maybe you all can read it the, the um, wording has um, come off of it so you know and then my computer my camera messing up is not making it really any easier but it looks like this and the thing that I like about it is the tip that's what it's all about anyways is the brush tip and I like that it's angled and what I use an angled tip for is to get close to the neck without actually you know um, try not to, t to paint the head so if I have an angled brush that really really does the trick for me so that's that brush and then the same day I got this brush and this is a, this is a royal a number two royal and um, Lang, Lang nickel. I got this from Michaels as well I don't know what this little part right here is for so I'm not gonna really worry about it yet I'm sure inshallah I'll figure out something maybe maybe we could do some leaves um, but um, I really like the tip I got this because I wanted to have you know do detailed work you know like do some flowers and things like that and you know you need that one of my favorite things about this brush though is this handle this part right here a lot of times when you're doing your painting you'll find that your hands will slide and slide down down the shaft there so this thing right here is really good. I've seen these on pencils 
and I never really needed one but while I'm painting yeah definitely like this feature and inshallah I want to go back to the store and get myself some more um, yeah so um, I think that's about it here's another brush though until I bought my brushes these were my favorite these are paint these are actually makeup brushes this one right here I like because it is so soft and it is so it is like perfect for making like hair if you want to make um come over here if you want to make hair on your doll this is really good if you want to do the hijabs this is really good for you know making that that um that line that curve this is really good for that it's not the best for flowers but you know it can make some pretty unique flowers I do like that this has an angle to it you know um, the angles I mean the, just every paintbrush just gives you so many possibilities so that's why I said even these um, jiggies right here I don't know maybe maybe there's they're good for more than just paper so that's about it for now I think I showed you the paint brushes one other thing that I want to say about the paint brushes is that it's really good to uh, use the bottom parts for um, dots <laughs> and if you want you know to do different size dots on your on your dolls clothes then you can use you know the different bottoms there are different size paint brushes I actually did the dots I was playing around on this paper and so this is like one of the designs I want to try on a doll not the shoes <laughs> not the boots but um, this design and I actually made those dots there with this paintbrush right here so yeah not too bad so that's all for now thank you for watching and I hope you all have yourself a wonderful, wonderful day, evening, whatever it is for you. Okay, take care.